Breaking news out of Brooklyn right now at noon, where earlier this morning there were reports of a missing nine-year-old boy in Midwood. Chopper 2 was over the scene and spotted the child who fit the description on the family's rooftop. Dan Rice is in Chopper 2 with more on how this happy ending came together. Dan. And Cindy, this is the first time we've seen something like this happen. We were dispatched by our assignment desk to come over here to the Midland section of Brooklyn to see what was going on with the reports of a missing child. We've seen these reports too many times. Child leaves for school, does not make it to school. Family worried, sick and to death, trying to figure out where their child is. So as my pilot Eric Ross and I were circling around the building, we came across a person sitting in a chair over here on the rooftop. We zoomed in with the camera. It appeared to be the child that fit the description of the missing child. Now our CBS New York, uh, New York News uh, assignment desk, they called the uh, police department. They sent officers from the 61st precinct up to the rooftop and sure enough, they found the child sitting in the chair. They gave us a thumbs up as they went down with the child. We were able to reunite him with his family just a few stories below. Again, a first for us, don't usually see that happen. Happy to help the uh, police and the family down here in Brooklyn. Cindy, back to you. Dan, this is an incredible story. I mean, how did you and Eric even react when you found out you actually found the boy? I got to be honest, Cindy, I was very surprised. I'm looking in and I'm reading the description that I have. I'm looking at what the child is wearing and I'm saying to Wanda on our assignment desk, this looks like the child we're looking for. And she agreed. The rest of the, uh, the assignment desk agreed. And when they called the police, uh, when they came up, they gave us a thumbs up. I was shocked, to be honest. Again, so happy to see it end this way because yeah, we've seen these stories drag on over the uh, years. And it's nice to see this one have a quick and happy ending. Oh, my gosh, Dan. Thank you so much to you, Eric, the team and police. Appreciate the story. Wow.